Hello, hello, hello. It's, this is Garden Talk Jamaican here again. I'm going to do my last potato harvest. Almost the last one. I have a few in a bucket, but those are not ready yet. But here I have a situation where my pumpkin fell over on the potato vines. And these potatoes are in a tire. So here is the pumpkin. What I, am, what I have done is cut away all the vines and left enough to kind of hold the pumpkin in place with a little bit of the makeshift harbor that I had for the potatoes to run on. And it's a big pumpkin. It's very heavy. I don't want to try to move it because then I would probably break the pumpkin vine. And it is not ready to be harvested yet. It's still a young pumpkin. Not there yet. So, I am going to see, I think it will be rather easy now to harvest the potatoes now that I have moved the vines off the, from around the pumpkin and just left enough to hold the pumpkin in place. Well, I think I've got the tire, not the tire, I think I've got the, the tripod in place with the phone, the camera. So we'll see what happened here. I don't know if I have anything in here though. Soil is dry. I don't think I gave it much water. Let's see if we have anything. Uh oh. Is this it? Okay. Let's see if we have any food in this one. Hmm. Not looking good. That's the roots. Mm -hmm. that, that's the roots. But no food yet. This is the seed that was planted. I have anything behind here. Maybe I'm doing it a little bit too early. I don't know. I think I may be doing it a little bit too early, but we'll see. Well, this is what we have so far, a little Japanese. It is edible. As if we have something here, I may have to remove the tire. Hey, I may have to take up this tire, you know. Let's see. I have a pumpkin in the soil <laughs> yeah and it's not a Japanese it's a look like it's a you have several that's gone down in the ground so what I'm gonna have to do is see what's up in because it was only a single tire so let's see what we have we have some stuff in there just got to move the tire I think it went went down in the ground here's another one Okay, let's go to this route and then I'm going to have to take up this tire. Okay. Is this? Maybe this is what I planted. I think this is what I planted. I think this is, this is the mama. 
<laughs> still fresh look at it last year I tried to this is what this broke from I think I have a pumpkin not a pumpkin a potato in the down in the ground it grew down because the tire was just one and a single tire and it's shallow so this is mm -mm. yeah this is not a real potato so I am going to mm, here's another band so it seems we have some stuff there but I have to remove the tire so I'm removing the tire it's a ding dong and see what we have underneath it uh -oh. <laughs> have a potato look at this a potato grew in the tire in the side of oh look at this oh mama mia look at this huge one they were ready look at that Woo, that's a big one let's see what else is here here's another one they were really ready Two small ones. <laughs> wow, there's something. This is a workout. Okay. I'm moving the tire. Just making sure that there's nothing hidden. can move this yeah so we're good people Okay, I have removed the tire. Let's see if I can reposition the camera for you to see what's on the, what has grown in the ground. Uh. Oh well, I think I've lost my gloves, so I've removed the tire, and here is <laughs> that huge potato that has gone down in the Georgia clay. Oh yeah, oh dear, I may have to use a pitchfork to get this out, but... Something in it. Mm -mm. I'm gonna get a pitchfork to take it out. I'm walking a minefield here. 
So I've got my, my pitchfork. So trying to dig around it. <laughs> this is a saga. The saga of the potato that grew down in the ground. I don't want to break it. I've gotten this far. In the meantime, let's take up this little vardaman. All right. <laughs> this is very, this must be an ugly potato. It's coming. All right. Hmm. Here it is. A big <laughs> potato. I think the curtain has got to it a little bit. There are a couple of holes in it. I don't think they have gone far. It's not bad. Look at it. So that grew in the ground from the tire. All right. So let's see what else we have. If there's anything else in this tough clay. This is something, man. We'll go up and see if there's anything else. Let's move this pitchfork. I won't need it anymore. Huh? I think it was that just that huge one that was in the soil. Of course, I was thinking, oh, maybe they're not ready because there were so many roots, but they are more than ready. All right. This is a regular white potato. I think I'll stick it back there. All right. I think that's the lot. So let's show you the total harvest from about four roots. I think it was four roots of potatoes. You see, sweet potatoes starting to grow. This is what it is. Not a great haul, but there were like leftover slips eh, that I just decided to add another tire, get some more food. So this is what it is. Two huge ones. Lord, they're so big. Look at them. Mm. Here they are. And one nice medium sized one. Ooh, let me put it up front where you can see it. Here it is. Right. Right. And a few small ones. I will not plant Vardaman anymore. They don't do too good. Mm -mm. It says it's supposed to be for the south, but eh, maybe something ain't right, maybe with the way I'm planting them. So, I thank you for watching my potato videos and any other videos I may put out. I appreciate you, and I pray that you do have a great harvest too, and that all is well. Subscribe to my videos. Thank you. And like them. Thank you. I appreciate you. Have a wonderful day. God bless you.